so this lady has uh, something wrong with her pancreas. I'm not quite sure what it is, but we'll try and find out. Okay. I think they suspect chronic pancreatitis. Ah, okay. Vous avez senti le tube dans la bouche. Respirez bien. Voilà, so big balloon, tip down. Voilà. Excusez-moi. Encore un petit coup. Encore un petit coup. Avalez un petit coup. OK, merci. Voilà. Essayez de dormir. Voilà. Can we... Uh, she's a little bit too high. This way, just uh, unlock this. Unlock the stretcher, please. Bring her down. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, like that. Thank you. Okay, so here we go. I don't think it's completely locked. There's her liver. Okay, so portal vein. It's very tight here. Okay, so portal vein coming out of the liver right here. So far, this pancreas looks pretty good to me. A little hyperechoic, maybe. Slightly prominent pancreatic duct. Out to the tail, out to the tail, there we go. Okay, so nothing major here. There's the spleen. Back around the genu here. Going down into the head if we can, so portal vein. So here's the ventral pancreas. And uh, not seeing much honestly under here. So what's going on? I'm going to go a little deeper in the antrum and come back. There we go. Okay, so here's her head of pancreas again. And I'm still not seeing much abnormal in this area here. So we'll go on the bulb. Okay, we just lost the air insufflation again, I think. It's been a problem with the buttons here. Ah, c'est là venir, ça. There we go. Okay, so into the bulb. Okay, into the bulb. So, uh, there's her, I just want to get a little deeper in the apex. Lost the air insufflation again. Oh, but you change this valve là, and it's your old valve. This valve is getting stuck here. I don't know what's wrong with it, but it's, uh, it's a Yvonne Kalu now. The burn out there. Okay, into the apex right here, so left. There's the portal vein right here, right here. Then I go right, there's the bomb that coming down here. So we're ahead of pancreas looks okay as well. I'm gonna go into D2 if I can. It's very strange. This valve really has to go here. I get it underneath into D2. But her, from here, her head of pancreas looks totally normal. There's nothing going on here at all. But she's a little uncomfortable as well. Okay, so I'm just trying to get into D2. There we go. I think we just made it. There we go. Again, I have no air, so I can't see where I'm going. There we go. Okay, so we're in D2. Tip max up, coming back. Just respire bien, madame. So here's the unsnip process over here. This all looks very good. So I'm not quite sure why they were suspecting anything wrong here, but there's your ventral pancreas. Looks totally normal. Okay, so the dark ventral pancreas, PD and bodyduct and PD there. Coming across the genu. 
Really nice views here. There's nothing going on. It's a strictly normal pancreas so far. Coming across the genu. Uh, okay. So I'll just show you the mediastinum quickly. So coming back, you go to 30 centimeters, face the front, because the left atrium is in the front. You find the big black thing that's beating here. Come to the edge of it. And if you don't, you should see the pulmonary artery. If you don't see it, use it because you're torqued too much this way. Just torque to the right, and you'll see it. It's a little pericardial fluid. So this is the subcranial space. Then you pull straight back, see a bit of trachea, then just tip up and left. And then you get pulmonary artery, aorta, AP window. That's it. So uh, strictly normal pancreas. It was a low probability anyway, because it was just saying uh, a nodular pancreas on CT.